Late today, a source told me that the boy who was killed is named Savian Ellis. His older brother, as you say, is facing gun charges, but he is not charged with pulling the trigger. Family members held hands and hung their heads in court. The judge allowed 22-year-old Walter Hendrick to remain just out of sight. Just give the court officer who's with you a thumbs up, please. Thumbs up. Hendrick is the brother of a 12-year-old boy identified by a source as Savian Ellis, who was found shot to death in the kitchen on the second floor of this apartment building in Mattapan. At the time of the incident, there was another younger sibling in the home under the age of 21, in addition to the 20, uh, in addition to the 12-year-old victim. Court documents say that younger sibling is just eight years old. Hendrick told police he kept a semi-automatic gun in a fanny pack that was left at the home. As you can tell, this is a tragic situation. Mr. Hendricks just lost his younger brother. He's supported here by his family who is sitting in the front row and other members of the community. Um, Good morning, everyone. They want him home. Hendrick is charged with illegal possession of a gun and not properly storing that gun. Police have not said who fired the shot that killed Savian. The boy's grandmother says she still doesn't understand the circumstances of the shooting. Till I get some answers, my feelings are not. It's not. I can't say whether I'm angry, pissed off, but it's not. The judge set bail for Walter Hendrick at $2,500, and his family posted that this afternoon, so he is now free.